Hello guys, and welcome back to some more Survival of the Yoshi. It's a pretty rainy, miserable day out today here on the Mountain Network, but our beautiful Lucy and Steve bodyguards, they're here to protect us from the rain. Yeah, on second thoughts, I don't know why we need protection from the rain. Welcome back though, guys. Today, we are going to be finishing off the first tree worth of treehouse. And I guess tree is like a measuring system now and let yeah Let me walk around here because I want to show you what I mean by that because things have changed again Not actually anything physical changing yet, but just ideas running through my mind of how I want this to all come and finish and Both of those words sounded way too hypersexualized for survival of the Yoshi I had a brainstorm I had to think about it as I said I kind of wanted something around that middle portion of the tree there and I wasn't really sure how I felt about the top So what I'm gonna be doing today at least, is, I'm gonna, you know what, let me wander up there now. Let's go up there and I'll actually show you instead of just kind of pointing to it with my mouse cursor like a complete idiot and hopefully I don't run into any monsters. Please, I'm just doing a demonstration. Okay, so at least it's, oh god, oh at least it's becoming daytime but that doesn't mean there aren't going to be any creepers out. Oh god, thank god I looked that way. Okay, well I guess this tree is as safe as we are going to get currently right now and there's a single block of stone. I think that's gra- I think that's gravel, yeah. Okay, I- I don't know why that's there. And there's a creeper down there too. What a story. What a story, Mark! That was an awful impression. <laughs> let's wander up here, Mr. Creepy Man. Please don't be still here. Okay, you're good. So let's wander up the treehouse. So all of this is gonna stay the same. I'm not making any changes, at least just yet, to all of this stairway bit. I'm happy with this. It works. It's great. We actually- well, the one change I may make, I may remove the vines at the bottom because they do kind of slow you down. But, so we get to the top here and then we go up the vines and this leads, as you guys saw last episode, if you're all caught up. And if you're not, by the way, go and check that out. I'm, the annotation thing has already swung by, I should have said it earlier, but just check it out if you didn't already. And then we get to this main room here at the top, which is looking horrific. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill in with just this wood. In fact, I can probably do it now. Just these parts here that kind of show underneath the base. And this is tricky because I didn't want to place too much of this down because I feel like the more of this I do, the less na- Okay, that's fine. The less natural it looks. The whole- Jeez! Oh my god, that was a- that was a direct drop. Hey! We got a shortcut at least. I want it to all look really natural is what I'm trying to say here. I feel like adding wood down even though it's on a tree, it's- it's not wood wood. It's log wood. So, it won't look as good. And that all rhymed. I didn't even know it. Now, I'm also going to replace the top bit of this as all wood as well. I then I know it's less natural, it's not as good, but it, it, we need we can't just be walking on leaves inside. In the end of the day, come on guys, let's, we may be Yoshis, okay? We, we are interesting creatures, we're not barbarians! Come on, be civilized a bit. Also, we're running into another problem. I have run out of all of that kind of wood! I need some more oak wood, because I, as you can see, I have all of this jungle wood in my inventory, still from last episode, to be fair. I didn't add that in there, especially for today, but we're going to be using that, because, I'll tell you what, what, before I go and get the oak wood, I'll tell you the second part of the plan today, because I've been building up to it and long enough. We're also going to build a room here, on, th on this kind of side of the tree, so my thoughts with this, we can actually have it. <laughs> Just had to think there for a second, which I don't do usually, you know. And we actually need to fix this too, but I'm going to have a little hole there just in the corner. Hopefully that will all line up, that will then go back down, probably with this kind of log, this jungle log, actually. Just to, you know, keep the aesthetic going. It's going to go down a little bit, and that will also be filled with vines. And then there'll be this second, bigger kind of room over here that we can wander into as well. Because the top is like the entrance to the mountain treehouse network. Because that's where every other part of this treehouse setup is going to be accessible from. And then this treehouse's main room is going to be here. And then we'll lead over to that tree there. I was also going to bring this up to you guys. I think I might build a treehouse set over on this one as well. I can have one bridge going that way. And one bridge going that way. And that would be amazing. Probably going to do that. i tell you what sounds like even better of a plan. Let's stop talking about what we're going to do for the treehouse. And go and do something in Survival of the Yoshi today. Come on. This, there was already a way too long of a gap between this episode and the last episode, which I do apologize for, by the way, guys. Uh, that's all me. That 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 was my bad. There is no other excuse for that. I, I, I just had a lot going on, and I had to take a week break from Survival of the Yoshi. We're back, though! Oh, my God. It's so nice to be back. 
Whenever I do have to take a little break or anything though, guys, I'm gonna be honest, the thing I do miss the most is always Survival of the Yoshi. There's something about it, I think it's the fact that it's been running for so long, we stopped and then we started it again and it came back in full swing, and now we're here at the Mountain Network, just years of reminiscing and nostalgia and beautiness. Not, not beautifulness or, or beauty, just beautiness. It is what it is. So yeah, I need oak trees. Are there many oak trees on this island? I don't think there are many oak trees on this island, for some reason. Which is not good. It can't, we could do better. I don't think there are any oak trees on this island. Come to look at it. Uh, I mean, yeah, it would make sense that it is all just jungle wood. I think we kind of already knew that. I don't know, I thought maybe further along there might be some that I can just chop down. No, these are all jungle as well. They're just smaller jungle. We got, we got adult jungle, baby, no, t this, adult jungle, teenager jungle. Yeah, I'm not to put him down or anything. And then baby jungle. D not quite getting your feet off the ground just yet, but getting there and growing up as you're doing it jungle. That's what that tree is. He hasn't even like, set his trunk out of the ground properly yet, but he'll get there. I believe in you! You got this. Okay. Yeah, there are no oak trees right now. Fantastic. I guess I'll just go and check in my, you know what, can I just, just can one thing go right today so far? Can I at least make the parkour jump? Either give me a bunch of oak, no, don't throw the food. I'm throwing my food in a temper tantrum. Either, guys, god damn it, either, I'm throwing all of this, give me an oak tree, or let me at least do the parkour part that I was trying to do. Don't take both of them away from me, you can take one. I accept that, this is a video, this is survival of the Yoshi. It's not all gonna come easy, that's the point of it. But, at least one. Actually, you know what? There is one blessing that I will count right now and openly admit. It has been a little while since we've actually had any ske OG Skelly Gang attacks here at the Mountain Network. We've had some in some of the quarries and the adventures we've been going on. But it's been a while since there's been anything here at the Mountain Network, which is pretty good. I This is my home. I like to feel safe here, so... I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not going to turn that down. I don't know whether they're just appreciating me. They respect me, maybe. Maybe I killed one too many, and then they realized. They were like, oh, this Yoshi. We don't want... Oh! Oh, no! Okay! They want to mess with me. Oh, my God. They faked me out. They faked me out big time. They literally waited until I said to you guys, hey, it's, it's been a while since any skelly attacks. And then, and there you go. They striked when I least expected it. Genuinely, that was when I least expected it. If anything, they've now got smarter. So, the opposite of what I was just saying. Great. We're screwed. We're dead. Please let there be some oak wood in here or something. I th you know what? I'm at a point. I'm so desperate for oak wood right now. I will take the two slabs to form the one single block I will get from it. I'll happily take that. And more. Yeah, sure. All right. Uh, now, birch wood we don't really need. There are some oak saplings. We should definitely plant some of these. I'm gonna do that in a little bit. Uh, do we have any more? No, none in there, and none in there. Okay, well, I'll tell you what then. Before I do go and figure out some kind of alternative, because we've got to get some oak wood somehow. Yeah, let me let me go and plant these, actually, because we could do with having some oak wood here on Survival of the Yoshi, especially in the Mountain Network. Yeah, not we, we have it on Survival of the Yoshi. We can do with some of it here. That's what I was trying to go for. I'm not sure if it's turning dark or what. There's, there's no way to tell. I'm, you know what? I'm just going to go in here. I'm going to try sleeping. I'm going to get the Skelly Gang out of my bed. This is my private sanctum. You know, oh, there's two of them. Of course there are. Wait, hold on. What what were the two of you doing in my bedroom? I, I ask while I kill you. What? Why we... Okay, you know what? I'm not going to even ask. I'm not going to even... Are there, are there more of you guys? Are you having a little party here? Chilling in my pool? Yeah, Good. Taking liberties, Skelly Gang. Taking liberties right now. And I can't sleep anyway, so this whole trip was pointless. Okay, you know what? This is <laughs> this is probably going to turn out pretty horribly. I'm not going to lie, but we're going to give it a go. Just because I don't... I know that when I'm going to go and chop these oak trees down, the only way... Well, the only place I could put them... Let's put it this way. That I could put them where I won't forget about them. Because there's so many trees here, I'm not going to pick out the oak ones from the jungle ones in my eye. 
in any way, and I will forget about it. So, to actually make this worthwhile and me actually pick these oak saplings up afterwards, or the oak wood that's going to come from them, we're going to take the sunset watching chair down. I know, heartbreaking. How could I do it? I'm a heartless soul. I know, I'm sorry, guys. And uh, we're going to place one there. This might actually be very atmospheric when we're walking across here and then there's trees eye level now. Who knows? We'll place one there. We'll place another one there. That could very well block our walking down here, actually. But, I mean, I guess we'll see what happens. We'll place... Yeah, this is going to be the really odd one out. We'll place... Hold on. Let's get, let's get this back. There you go. Let's get that there. We'll place one on there. Oh, I love it. Oh, it's fantastic. You know what? We could do this twice, actually. We, uh, oh no, we can't because we need to build it across. Get the dirt back. Ah, I missed it. Okay, well, we'll keep that there. We can place one of you on there. We do have the bones in our inventory as well, so we can grow them right now. Come on. I believe in you. Grow! Oh, God! You've got... That was perfect timing. Of course it's a baby tree! I wanted a big, majestic, look at this grand mountain network I'm entering into tree. Not, hi, I'm two years old and... I don't know what wood is, even though I'm made out of it. I don't know if you guys knew, trees are, trees are really dumb. Especially when they won't grow, oh my, okay. Okay, see that one took a bit more nurturing. You know, he's a teenager, he's growing up a little bit, you're kinda cool, you're, you're, you're just kinda erect, right? <laughs> if there is one word, listen, I'm not gonna go pussyfoot around it, if there was one word to describe this tree, guys, I'm pretty sure it's erect. Yeah, that's that's the teenage tree. And let's do one more. Oh, you're kind of you're like preteen. You're right in between. Look, we got the family. This is what this is. Hello baby tree. Hello child tree. Hello teenage tree. And then all of the other trees around here are adults because they've been here for years. Genuine years. We built a family today. Who would have thought that? The heartbreaking thing about this is that uh yeah, I got to break it down. I'm sorry, Teenage Tree. I chose you because you're the oldest. You'll understand more, all right? You'll get it. You'll understand why I've got to do this. You know I love you. Don't ever say that I don't, because I do. The best part about all of this is that that wood that we got from that one Teenage Tree, the fact that I'm actually referring to it as a Teenage Tree is pretty great. Uh, the oh, oh no, no, don't be, oh, please say you didn't blow up a part of the, okay, what, wow. That was far too close. Oh, oh, God, that was far too close. And I've just realized I need some more vines. Do I have any more vines? Oh, I'm out of vines. Oh, okay, you know what? You know, actually, there's there's a solution here. Hold on, this could look quite nice. I've had an idea. Let's break these two wooden blocks here. And let's just crouch, because, come on, Yoshi. You know how to Minecraft now. Ah, oh, don't, don't you love how slow this is taken? There could be a creeper up in this treehouse right now, and I wouldn't know about it until he decided to explode. I mean, with the time that I've been digging this block, I'm pretty sure there's not. There could be. Just be sneaky. Why is it taking this so long? If this is some stranded raft rain kind of stuff. What are you doing? Come oh my god, that was horrible. You suck. You suck block. I'm not even going to do the second one. No, I'll do, I'll do the second. Oh! That's why. Because it's part of that weird block slab thing that we found from about three years ago when there must have been an update in Minecraft and it just completely screwed up the game. Uh, but all we wanted to do as well is just place half slabs because I think we'll probably be able to climb onto that, right? Ah, oh, we can't. Okay. Oh, well, there's one more solution. What if we destroyed one like that? Okay. Okay. So this is kind of natural feel as well. So you step on the leaves. You step on the first block. It's like a little stairway up. Okay, we'll keep that. We'll keep that style going. I think that works. And now the moment we've all been waiting for. The 20 wood blocks. Just, just 20. That we will get from that tree. There's not going to be enough to finish this building. We do also need some glass. Because that's what's going to go in these holes here. I'm pretty sure I've got glass down in the network. We'll get that in a sec. In the meantime though. Let me let me just kind of build up all around this then. And see the design we're kind of going with. I'll imagine where the glass is. I'll just kind of ignore it for now. So it's all good. So there's that. And yeah. Basically what I decided this was going to be. Is obviously in between now and the last episode. You guys could probably see. I was kind of struggling on what I actually did want it to be. And we can actually finish this off with oak slabs. That kind of works out. Nice. I was struggling on what I wanted this to be. Because I don't want it to be bigger than this. 
on top of the tree, because then I think it will like outweigh the tree. But I also don't want it to be smaller than this to actually have a use, because what are you going to place in here? So what this is, is this is kind of the connector. This is the in-between part. See this less of an actual part of the treehouse, and more a part of like the stairway, if that makes sense. Because you wander up here, this is like a hallway, and then there'll be... A part out here that goes to that bridge over there. A part out here that goes to that bridge over there that will have those trees for the treehouse on there. And then this can, I guess, just be a viewing window or something. Maybe we could build like a balcony out on here. But that's what this is going to be. So there's no furniture in here. I'll probably make it look nice and figure something out. But for now, guys... Until we go and get the glass and just sort that out. And there will be a roof on that, but I'm not going to put that in right now because I'm not exactly... Wealthy with the right kind of wood right now. He says on this island that is literally just trees. However, the great thing about this island literally just being jungle trees is that the second thing we're doing today is made out of jungle wood. So we're not going to be running out anytime soon now. Thank God. So this is the second part of the treehouse that I wanted to do. And I kind of have it envisioned in my mind how I want it to look. And I don't figure it out actually in per And I haven't figured it out in person just yet. So this is going to be interesting. This is going to be another Yoshi attempts to build some stuff and it kind of works out and kind of doesn't. Almost. Apparently. Yes. We might as well actually just link it to this tree here, not have like a second log stair, stair, log tower that goes down and just attach it to this and we can use these vines here as the entrance to the base. In fact, let me, let me break through here just like this. And then that's right in perfect. That's into the floor of this little connector area for the network. There you go. And then we can just drop down here and boom. We're into the second part. Oh, God. I thought the tree was decaying more because there's a second hole. But no, we're good. I can't look up and move. I should not be looking up and moving in any way here because I will fall down. Right. Let's actually place this down then. So it's going to be all out of jungle wood. And I would say, let's stand down here. I would say that. Maybe that is a good height to have it on. So if we were building all around there, I don't know if I want entrance accessible in through there because the whole point of it is this second thing and then you can drop down and ah, you're into this area now. So we will cover that off. You won't just be able to go up the vines and slide your way on into that area there. But yeah, I think this height is perfect. It's not going to carry on around this way. We don't have to worry about that. Let's build it all around here a little bit. There you go. I think it just kind of goes outwards now, if that makes any sense. Outwards a little bit. I don't want it to be ugly and just look like it's just slapped onto this tree. But, I mean, you've seen my build battle video by now, right, guys? I'm not the, the most amazingly creative builder out there. My Minecraft builds, they consist of... A few topical things that a lot of noob builds will find in them. Uh, corners like that that are just kind of not really cared about. Just trying to look stylized, but they're not really. They're just, they're just a dumb little corner. Weird shapes that you're trying to make intuitive and look really different. But again, you know, they're, they're just, they're just shapes. And, uh... Yeah, bumbling commentary over the top of it while you do it to kind of seem like you make sense and know what you're doing when you're building things and you actually have a really good plan. Um, but then you add in that little bit of twinge in your voice every now and then and then the viewer realizes that ah, he has no idea right now. He's just winging it and hoping it looks good. I mean, no, this was completely planned out in my mind earlier from the episode yesterday today. A month ago. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We have our little foundation, I guess, floor foundation. I kind of want to go down really quickly and just look what it looks like. Because I don't know if I want to make any changes to it before I build the wall up. So let's hook onto this vine here. Oh, God. These are lifesavers. I need some food as well. I have all this food. Why am I not eating it? I will very, very quickly die if I don't do that. Oh, my God. Right, so let's take a look at this then. Hopefully it looks mucho bueno. I think honest because it looks newbie right now. I said this last episode as well and there are a lot of comments about it as in like, yeah, okay. It looks newbie when he builds it, but at the end, you know, it might be quite nice like the mountain network did. When I was building all of this, guys, when I was building this noob elevator and this pathway and every you guys saw me doing this. You thought this was the dumbest thing in the world, but is it? No. So give me a chance. 
You see the stairway still? That's good. You see, th you see the bit at the top as well. Speaking of which, while I'm down here, I'll try and get some glass. I mean, the back of it, the front part here, kind of looks, the shape-wise, it looks like it could be the back side of a house. So, if we could design it in that kind of- Oh, my voice is going everywhere today. Tree houses are exciting me. If, if we could design it in the kind of sense that it is like the back of a regular house that's just been plumped in a tree, that could look really cool. So, I think that's what I'm going to try and go for, uh, which we will do today as well. So, let's go down here, though. Let's get some of this glass. Because I at least want to finish the top of that little connector room off. And I'll actually make the ro the roof- I was going to say the room. The roof will be made out of this jungle wood too. So we can finish that off right now as well. Unless I have no glass. Nope, there you go. I swore I did see glass at some point when I was going through all of these chests. I was like, game, do not be playing these games. I know that you're a game and your job as a game is to play games with the person who is playing the game. Who, because they are playing the game, you would expect to enjoy being having games played on them. Right? So, game, Minecraft, don't be playing that game of hiding the glass. Just trying to figure out what I just said there. Okay, I'm kind of gonna have to get used to that. Right, let's put the glass in then, see what this all looks like. Not really when it's done, because I'm sure there will be things we'll add to this after we've actually got this first room here down as well. But, I mean, you know, for the moment, it's alright. It's in a better state than it was in before. That's what we can say about it. So, let's place this roof on here. You guys already guessed what kind of roof I'm gonna do. That's right. The typical roof that Yoshis do. Which is the one where it just kind of circles the outer edge of the wall and then it just keeps circling it upwards like this. And, and then it looks great. Right? It looks so fantastic. Oh my... Ah, oh, look at that. It's, it's beautiful. It's just beautiful. But there you go! It actually, if, if, now that it's sealed off and sunlight isn't coming through it, it does feel a lot more homely. I'm not gonna lie. And I have had another idea as well, with this being the connector room, just a side thing, I wanna place like, a group of fences around here, because this is gonna be, this is like the entrance to it, but this is an exit. There could be other exits in here. I mean, there are gonna be, there's gonna be one for that bridge there, and one for that there. So, we need to design that around that kind of idea of it being an exit. If this is making any sense, as it's coming out my mouth, I hope it is. Because if it does, then it's kind of got its own theme to the room. Because that's going to look like an exit, and that's going to look like an exit. And then this room, this hole here, can also look like an exit. I need to stop talking about exits. It's not turning out well for me today. With our very last little bit of jungle wood, let's design this last bit of the house. And I've got, I'm actually going to go with an idea here. You know what? I want to make kind of like a balcony. I want a balcony on this build. I think if there's got to be a balcony anywhere, it would be on this one, guys. It it just suits it. You can look over everything, you can spy stuff, so I'm leaving this one block foundation around it. Because what that's going to be used for is, I want a balcony that goes around the whole thing. Like, imagine this is a modern kind of New York or like London, Paris, one of those kind of cities. This is a modern high rise, right? As you can clearly see. Modern high rise. So, and the balcony starts from this corner, goes all the way around, so you get a full kind of almost 360, aside from this section here. 360 view! Oh, see, that's why we need to leave the vines up, because they are literally going to save my life. And uh, that did also make me realize, yeah, let's, let's put a balcony section there. So this will actually probably a bit be a bit more built out, but I don't know where I want the door for the balcony access yet, or anything like that. And I don't really know what I want this room to be, now that you guys have got the size of it, and you can see what we can maybe put in there. That's going to be the question of today's episode, by the way, guys. What would you like to see me put on the interior of this room? It can be anything to do with Minecraft, so Minecraft items. It can be any of the furnishing items as well, so get, uh, crawfishes furniture, it's in the chat, I think, it's, it's in the, crayfishes furniture mod, there you go, if you actually want to know what I am able to craft on this series, guys, go to that website link down there, I don't think I've ever spoken about this, go to that and you guys can see all the items that I could place in here, and you can suggest layouts, perhaps, that would be really cool. But, for the moment, the balcony is going to be put on hold, the furnishing is going to be put on hold, all I'm going to do, is place up these walls, figure out where I might want some of these windows as well, and see what it looks like. Okay, this is kind of weird. I don't know where this idea came from, 
But I kind of like that window design. It's like a smiley face. We're going to look up at this and it literally will look like a smiley face. Uh, I don't know where this really came from, but I think it kind of works, honestly. And maybe we could even do like a second set up there. I need to still finish this off. We're also going to have some there, one in there. I was actually thinking maybe this is where the door could be for the balcony and then we'll expand it out there just around the corner. That could be cool. But I'll leave that until next episode in case you guys want me to change that or a different idea comes to mind. Uh, and then I'll mirror the same on that side there, which means I need to figure out the wood for this part. So give me a second with that. And oh, we're all out of jungle wood. So you know what? Even though we're surrounded by all of this jungle wood, I'm going to finish this episode off here because I want to get your feedback again. I want to see what you guys think I should furnish this top room with. You don't really have to comment about the design of the next room we're building if you don't want to because that will be finished next episode within the first five minutes and that's not going to be the focus of that episode at all. Next episode, we're probably going to focus on finishing furnishing that room, adding some design as well to the top segment would be really cool, and then probably doing something completely different from Three houses here in the mountain network just for the rest of the episode because the past three episodes I believe maybe even four have been dedicated to this one single build and I'd like to change it up for you guys a little bit just to give you some kind of variation but there you go guys that's how it's looking right now uh, again the roof isn't added on yet and I will ha I'm gonna have kind of a sticky out kind of roof that has some design on it so that will add to the look of it and it just kind of looks half done right now but the windows I think I might change looking at it from here uh, I don't like that top row and I think I might do some kind of spotty design thing with the bottom row as well. We'll see. But I'm liking it so far. It's coming together. We have space to walk around and live in now, which is great. And uh, something we do need to get onto soon as well, though. And that's definitely going to be, if not in the next episode, when we're taking a break, the one afterwards, is the pathway, the official pathway, up to actually accessing this, which is going to stem off here. And actually, you know what? Now that we've placed that tree in there, that tree placement is perfect for this. We can split it down. This one goes four blocks wide. This one goes four blocks wide here, so up against here. And it just grazes the tree. That's perfect. We need to leave that tree right there. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching this episode of Survival of the Yoshi. Don't worry, if you're not digging the tree stuff, there will be some variation next episode. And if you really are, then there'll be lots more of that coming soon as well. Thank you guys for watching. I've been Yoshi Mario. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And until the next one, guys, I'll see you all a little bit later.